defeat your opponents. Yo, what's going on? Welcome to the video. Today I'm gonna be doing some uh, commentary or some PvP. I'm playing Clash. The map is uh, Pacifica. I'm playing as a warlock, and I'm using the uh, Vigilance Wing, the Mighty Mini Tool, and some generic rocket launcher. As you guys know, I'm mostly a PVE guy, not a PVP guy. But I do play a uh, PVP once in a while, mostly because I'm forced to, so I can rank up my character. And sometimes when I get bored of PVE, I do jump on here and play a couple games. I don't stay here long. But as I said on my last commentary, which was uh, last week, I said that I was I was gonna try to mix up the content just to keep things fresh. And that's why I'm uploading this uh, video for you guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoy it. I went on a 21 or 22 kill streak, which is uh, pretty good for me because I don't I rarely play uh, PVP. I got one of those uh, fancy medals. Uh, the we we ran out of medals. I think that's the highest medal in this game. I'm not really sure. I don't play a lot of PvP, like I said. And look at this guy camping. People crouching and camping. <laughs> why would you play that? Why would you play a game if you're gonna camp or sit in a corner? Like I don't understand. I mean, I'm not trying to tell people how to play or anything, but why would you play a game if you're gonna stand in the corner and and, and not move or you know, like how's that fun? How do people have fun just like sitting in corners and camping and I don't know, whatever. But like I was saying, uh, damn, what was I talking about? I lost my uh, train of thought. Oh yeah, uh, PvP. Um, yeah, I don't play a lot of PvP. This was my second uh, game. I was doing my milestones. I got a pretty good score, so I thought you guys might be interested in watching this gameplay. But uh, anyways, uh, on my last video, I, I was trying to do a serve video, you know, because the the, the DLC, DLC had just dropped, so I thought uh, serve might have some uh, my new um, exotics. Obviously, that didn't happen, so I said that uh, if uh, Sir where to bring new exotics this week I was gonna do another commentary but that didn't happen either sir didn't have any new exotics this week so I figured I'd do a commentary over some PvP since sir is uh, pretty much irrelevant I don't know why uh, Bungie is not giving us uh, sir any new exotics to sell I mean what's the point of a uh, even having Sir, or what's the point of Sir coming uh, every week if you uh, they're not gonna give him new exotics to sell or new uh, things to sell? Why don't you give him uh, like uh, heavy ammo synthesis or special ammo synthesis? I don't understand. Like why uh, why are they not uh, bringing back uh, heavy and special ammo synthesis? Is it a balancing issue or or what? It seemed to me that it worked just fine in, in Destiny 1, so I don't understand why in Destiny 2 there are no heavy ammo synthesis. But if you're not going to let them sell heavy or special ammo synthesis, what about glass needles from Destiny 1, which were used to reroll the perks on exotics? How come you don't bring those back? And look at this bullshit. I was hitting them straight on with my super. And he still had the time to shoot me with a rocket. See, this is why I don't play a lot of PvP. There are a lot of bullshit deaths like that. Was that lag or what? And as you guys just saw, I wasn't moving. I dropped my controller. I was about to rage. I'm not a rage quitter. But deaths like that would probably make anybody rage. And I think that was my last death before I go on a roll. But yeah, um, do something to make uh, Sir relevant. Give him a new item or something, because he's pretty much useless at the moment. 
All right, that's all I gotta say about Sir. I think we all can agree that Sir is pretty useless at the moment. Let's move on. I want to talk about the DLC real quick. I've been enjoying the DLC so far. I've been having a lot of fun. The only thing that I don't like is the new infusion system. You need like four different things to infuse a piece of armor or a weapon. I think they should just go back to the way it was where you only need glimmer and charged. But I do like the fact that you can now infuse uh, shotguns into rocket launchers or snipers into grenade launchers. You were not able to do that before. They did it like it was in Destiny 1, which I like. But probably one of the best things that they added to this game is Gambit, which is a new game mode in this game. It's a combination between PvE and PvP. It's 4v4, and whoever kills their boss first wins. Obviously, I haven't played the raid yet. My power level is 510. I'm not even sure what the required level is for the raid. Probably 560. I'm not even sure, to be honest. But hopefully, the new raid is better than the Leviathan raid. Because, like I said, I've only played it once. But everything leading up to the boss was pretty boring. People say that the boss fight is fun. But I never got to fight the boss. People kept leaving the game. I kept trying to find people to finish the raid. <laughs> but again, people kept leaving, so you know I just got I just got fed up and I never finished the raid. I gave up. But if uh, any of you guys want to do the raid with me, send me a message. I've been trying to look for uh, people to do the, all the raids. I haven't played any of the any of the other raids. The people that I used to raid with in Destiny 1, they don't play Destiny anymore. So I'm trying to find new people or a new team to hopefully do the, the raid at least once a week. So yeah, if you guys want to join my party, let me know. And yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about. I want to get back to the gameplay real quick. At the beginning of this game, I was playing pretty uh, recklessly, so I took a few deaths. But eventually I started playing a little bit smarter, as we get a Sunbreaker trying to rush us. Thankfully my teammate took him out with a Noble Bomb. Otherwise, I probably, I probably would have been dead. I think I'm on a 15 kill streak right now. And I see a guy to the right of us. And I shoot him down. And as you guys can see, I'm rushing all over the map. I'm not sitting in the corner. You know, I'm not going to do that. That's pretty lame. It's pretty boring. I see this guy trying to come around us and shoot us in the back. I put some damage on him. He tries to run away. Now usually if you chase somebody you're probably gonna die but I knew that he was probably gonna try to head glitch me by the stairs and I take him out. I keep my streak alive as I make my way back to the middle of the map and pick up this heavy. Now I have this um, blue engram rocket launcher. I shoot this guy and he takes no damage whatsoever. And you know, this, this rocket launcher is pretty trash. This guy tries to rush me with a shotgun and I take him out. And there you go, we ran out of medals. So I was pretty happy. I did not expect to get this type of gameplay. I think that's my second or third we ran out of medals in this game. Not bad considering that I rarely play PvP. And this is the same guy that tried to rush me last time. He ends up killing me this time, but who cares? I already got the medal and the game is about to end. So it doesn't really matter. And that's pretty much it. The video is coming to an end. If you guys enjoy any part of the video, give a like, comment, and subscribe. 
as I take out this camper. Thanks, and have a good day. Later. No regrets on that one. Well fought.